Finally, it's over. Ariana Grande will not be charged for Donut Gate. Good morning, Holly Scoopers. It's your host, Jessica Carroll. Today is a great day. Why? Well, because the Donut Gate has finally come to an end. Yes. And guess what? Ariana Grande won't have donut liquor on her criminal record. Could have called that one. Yeah, a rep from Riverside County Sheriff's Department told TMZ that the owner of Wolfie Donuts does not want to press charges. So, case closed. Now, in case this is the first time you've ever heard of the Donut Gate, which I would be seriously surprised considering it's been making headlines around the world for way too long, let me give you the 101. Our girl Ari was caught licking donuts on video published on TMZ, and while police were investigating the case, Grande went on to issue two apologies, one written and one videotaped. In the video, she said, Here I am apologizing to y'all, lovey cheeks and all, um, because I feel like um, seeing a video of yourself behaving poorly that you have no idea was taken is such a rude awakening that you don't it's like you don't know what to do. I, I was so disgusted with myself. Perhaps it was this four minute apology video that did the trick. But regardless, we're sure the one more time singer is breathing a sigh of relief now that she has one less problem on her plate. The donut shop on the other hand, yeah, not so much. I hate to say this, but the innocent Wolfie donut shop is the loser in this case because after the health investigation, the shop went from an A to a B score. So sad. Ariana tweeted yesterday, quote, Love you babe so much. Can't wait to get to Tampa, sing for y'all, and grab as many hugs as I can. Talk to you very soon. Oh, and I missed you the most. So clearly the singer is back in action with no criminal charges and no more fat cheeks from her wisdom teeth. Are you guys happy with the results or did you want to see Ariana get a little bit of a spanking? Let me know below.